Cop, not a detective? Detective, yeah. I'm a lieutenant. Oh, okay. Gotcha. So you're excited? Yeah, I'm pretty excited. Are you excited? Yeah. So, what do you want to do? Where's your room at? So, Lieutenant. What's up? What are we investigating tonight? Nothing much. What's your plan here? I just drove down here to... And how, how long was the drive? <laughs> five and a half hours. Now, what wow. would motivate somebody to drive five and a half hours to come here to this house? I don't know, sir. But you got to know. You're the one who did the driving. I know. Now, you're a lawman. So if you're doing the interview, what would you want to know most? Basically, why was I here? Yeah, why were you here? I'm just, you know, I'm just lonely. I don't have anybody and I need somebody to talk to. You knew she was 13. She told you. And I was kind of worried about it. I, I told her I'd, <laughs> she was five years older. I didn't mind talking to her. But, but you kept talking anyway. Yeah. You wouldn't know what to do with me. Am I supposed to know what to do with old men? Dang! Maybe with me. <laughs> So this is funny. I know. I'm sorry, sir. It's funny. What do you think should happen to a police officer who gets caught doing something like this? Well, really bad could happen. How long have you been in law enforcement? Just a year now. Explain to me why somebody with apparently so much going on would take that risk. I mean, it doesn't make sense to me. I'm going through a divorce partially. And... So that makes it okay? No, it's not okay. It's, it'll never be okay. Not for anybody. What do you suppose your chief's going to say about this? He's going to be too happy. Well, there's something you got to know. And it's I'm Chris Hansen with Dateline NBC. And we're doing a story on adults who try to meet young teens online for sex. I apologize. Man to man. All right. He gathers up all his belongings and heads to the door, apparently thinking the worst is over. Because of the possibility that Patterson is armed, an officer acts more quickly than usual, calling out to him as soon as he opens the door. Patterson steps back into the house, and an officer shoots him with a taser gun. Only one probe stays attached, so the taser is unable to shock him and drop him to the ground. 